so my, my name is Christine and I'm live from Gloucester from a very sunny day today and I'd like to welcome you all. Um, I will be taking over this session yet again and today we will discuss how can we stop or minimize the use of plastic so quite an environmental topic today. Um, so I'm very excited to hear what, if you come up with anything new, maybe you come up with things that we didn't think about before. So I'd like to, uh, I'd like to hear uh, what you've got to say about it. So let's start off with Arush. Arush, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? My name is Arush Kumar. I studied in class four. My school name is Delhi Public School, University of Kolkata. And my favorite object of playing is very good. And what did you do today? So can you arrange your volume a bit? Oh, because it's everywhere. Now can you hear me? Better, much better. So tell me what you did today, because I I couldn't hear you properly. Okay, so first I woke up in the morning at eight o'clock. Mm -hmm. Then I got for my classes. After my classes, I was playing till three o'clock. Then from three to four, I just said slept. Then from four to five, I just stopped. Watching mobile, watching phone, then from five to six, I was just I was just getting ready, getting ready for my classes. For my six to seven thirty online classes, then I joined my class. After my class, there was a break for half an hour only, so I was just playing. Then I joined your class now. Very good. Thank you. Excellent. So, how can we minimize or stop the use of plastic? I'm going to tell uh, today I'm going to tell some five tips of how can we avoid using plastic like how how do we stop using of plastic mm -hmm. so for my first point is carry a reuse bottle everywhere like like you might have heard uh, like plastic bottles there are lots of you should buy steel bottle or a normal bottle, not mm -hmm. not plastic bottles, because the plastic bottle they can break anytime. Like it has happened with me before. Mm -hmm. And like in the fact factories where everything is recycled and everything. So from from the from the factories from the factories you might have seen some bad smoke. Like in like smoke comes out from the factory chimneys. Mm -hmm. So that's why we should avoid using plastics. And my second point is, is my second point is say no to plastic straws. Like uh, whenever we go, whenever we buy juice or something or any drink, so we get a plastic straw. So we should avoid those. Okay, very but good. This is a reusable coffee cup, like a coffee cup. I don't know, like a paper coffee cup. You should. Keep not the plastic one because the plastic one can anytime broke or and can plastic any time. Mm -hmm. I told you right now, plastic also makes pollution. Like in the factories, when plastic are uh, and from the plastics are made bottles and lots of things which, which are made. So from from those smoke, those are just the plastic chemicals or something. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much, Arush. Do you have any other any other yes. suggestions? Yes, yes. I have two more. Avoid, oh, avoid like use refill stations for detergent. Like mm -hmm. we should do like that. Big. I have never did like that. Okay. Like, refill stations. Like whenever we go to the petrol pump or something, we should. Uh, We can use a, a normal cloth bag. Like uh -huh. if we use the cloth bag, 
so uh, we we don't need to throw we we can use any time we want good so like when okay. clothes are a, when the clothes are a bit old then we throw we but we use the we should use the clothes one because the clothes one is better from the plastic ones okay very good and, and you can wash it and use again because it is unlimited you can wash use wash use wash use like that and yeah. my last and my last point is say no to disposable plastic cutlery okay good and why do you say no yes like you might have heard the those uh, plastic ones that that in the parties we just uh, bought mm -hmm. it can be also it, it can also be health problems mm -hmm. okay good very so good excellent and a plant and a bamboo like some bamboo tree like uh, bamboo trees cutlery you should not use the plastic one because the plastic one just gets broke i like it has happened with me good it thank you very much also because it has a lot of pollution in it it can make you thank you thank you arush okay very good excellent so let's move on to Bisman. Bisman, uh, can you introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day, please? Good evening. Bisman? Sorry? Are your voice is cracking? Oh, my voice is cracking. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Uh, is it better now? Uh, yes, ma'am, it's better now. Okay, good. I think there was a tiny lapse there. Okay, so um, Bisman, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, good evening, everyone. I am Bisman Kaur. I'm from Bhubaneswar, class 7, class 8B. I uh, I study in Loyola School and my hobbies are to play other games. And my today's day was really good. Today I went to my school uh, to get my class eight stationeries and books. And it was really fun. I met a few of my classmates and uh, we again became really good friends there. And um, we went for some uh, grocery shopping also. So it was really fun day today and I started with my studies because I got my book back. So um, it, like actually the English books were really thick so I got a bit nervous for my class 8 studies. But yeah, it was fine later on when my mom said me it's like an extra book. Only one is the school books I got. I'm fine with it. And it was really fun going through my class 8 book. It was really interesting. Excellent. Very good. Excellent, this man. So can you tell me, how do you think we can reduce or stop the use of plastic? Uh, so ma'am, um, I think so we can reduce plastic, uh, like most of our plastic goes into the kitchen. Uh, like um, uh, we should stop uh, getting parcels at home and order food how much we can have instead of ordering one plate and not having it because they will give the parcel in a plastic uh, like in a plastic mm -hmm. container that black plastic container and I feel like most of the hotels use the plastic container while they use a lot of money in decorations so um, I think so we can stop when we uh, stop ordering the food in a really large amount we should order it in uh, some extent not in a really large amount that we can't complete or finish it at that moment so we should order things in a limit in a limitation so that we don't waste food the next one which i feel we should follow is like these days the plastic plastic uh, juice juice bottles are really decorative like the fruity bottle is of plastic but still it's so decorated no one notices it 
it's all yellowish a lot of writings on it that people like don't mark on it instead of we like instead of having fruity we can have a can juice or a um, or we can have the bottle one uh, these days uh, we have can as a steel so that is better than plastic uh, so i feel like we should stop using um, uh, uh, plastic uh, juice bottles and use cans uh, because uh, like amul cool is really product uh, really nice so we can easily use them and the third point which i want to say is um these days what happens the government has given the dustbins as one is the wet for wet products and one is for dry products because if because um, all the plastic is in the form of uh, dry product like plastic cannot be watered it cannot be included in a wet product so uh, uh, the whole dry box will be um, uh, covered with the plastic so we can easily recycle them if we put wet products in it the plastic will get ruined and because the plastic uh, the um, dry dust will needs a lot of time to uh, get come like to be uh, to be filled with a lot of items so um, if we mix it with wet items for few uh, within few days the uh, plastic will get ruined so that is what i feel is people don't understand the difference between the wet dustbin and the dry dustbin when it's clearly mentioned on the dustbin that put only wet ingredients and dry ing ingredients like if you have any um wet products so put it uh, inside the, the inside this dustbin and uh, dry has this one and the last point recently i got assignment on um this topic only so we were finding about it and um, i got to know that chewing gum is also made up of plastic like the actual chewing gum which we eat is of plastic so we can recycle them also so and chewing gum is not a wet ingredient so we can put put it wrap it and put it in a dry dustbin also so uh, it was really interesting for me to think that Uh, that chewing gum is made up of plastic, and I think the chewing gum should be stopped because chewing gum has ruined so many people's life. If we say that smoke is really bad, we because we inhale it, but chewing gum we have it. Someone uh, like some people swallow it also, and when I see that, I feel like they don't know that it's a chewing gum. Even if they know that it's a chewing gum, they still swallow it. So for me, that was really surprising. So um, I feel like. we should uh, we should find the difference between why the government has given a wet dustbin differently and a dry dustbin as the government has taken the initiative so we should also take the initiative we have to just put the uh, uh, particles in the dustbin so if we put it in a wet one or a dry one it's not a big difference like we have to put it put it in any one we have to just follow the uh, process what is given So I feel like we should follow this. That can reduce a lot of, uh, like, uh, plastic, like, uh, plastic because it can be immediately recycled. And if it is, uh, if the uh, wet ingredient is put in together, the plastic will will take a lot of time to recycle. Till that it will get dis decomposed and will be, uh, will be like smoky. It will make the air smoke. Uh, filled with smoke. So I feel like that is the best way to make the uh, make plastic uh, like minimize the use of plastic. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, thank you very thank much. You, uh, let's move on to Navya now. So Navya, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? Good evening. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening. How are you, ma'am? I'm good, thank you. Yes, ma'am. A uh, good evening, everyone. My name is Savya Karwal. I study in class seven in Calcutta, and uh, my day was a bit hectic because today I went to school, and uh, we had some uh, vaccination over there. So, uh, my first dose. So I'm feeling a bit woogly woogly. So <laughs> I came. So I came home and rest, and then I did some chores, and then I'm joining your class. Excellent, very good. Uh, so tell me, Navya, um, uh, what do you think? How can we stop or reduce the use of plastic? Uh, Ma'am, first I will say that we should stop avoiding. Uh, we should stop using things 
which are completely made of plastic like straws or bags and we should like some women or even men they know how to sew so we should like tell them to sew us some bags so instead of always taking a grocery bag from the shopkeeper whenever we take groceries we always say that uh, you should give us extra bag so that's also plastic so we should always take an extra bag or we should sew one so it will it will be a bit reducing mm -hmm. okay good anything else uh, Mela, anything? can you hear me yes anything else that you would like to add ma'am i can't hear you um can anyone else hear me Sonny, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, so Navia, Navia, can you hear me now? Navia. Something, Mama, are you saying something? Yes. Okay, so I think they have a bit of an issue here. Um, so I will write to Navia. Hello, ma'am. Okay. Hi, Riaz. How are you? I'm good, thank you. So, Riaz, since you've jumped in, uh, you can join in. Uh, can you introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? Yes, yes, yes. I'm from Kashmir, especially in Srinagar. Mm -hmm. um, especially in Srinagar, Kashmir. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh, I am a student and uh, I have done my pharmacy. I am running my pharmacy shop. Now I okay. need support to learn this uh, this language very well. Your pronunciation, yes. very, your pronunciation is very good. I attract Thank to. you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, so tell me a bit about your day. Yes, I'm not actually actually, ma'am. I'm not hearing your voice properly because of uh, I'm from full of, uh, Kashmir because no four G service has not been fully down over here. Okay. Um, so, Riaz, can you hear me now? Yes. Yes. Okay. So, tell us a bit about your day and tell us how you can reduce or stop the use of plastic. Plastic is harmful to us because plastic is not good, uh, is not made in good things because they are um, raw materials are not good. I, we cannot understand and we cannot see what the company when the manufactured plants have made this plastics either they are the uh, raw materials are good or not we cannot uh, we can only see the colors of plastic bags uh, uh, utensils etc but i cannot judgment these plastic bottles are good or not before now, uh, first uh, when I purchase the medicine and when I prescribe the medicine to people or other uh, patients, they are manufactured in mirrors, mirror type. Nowadays, the bottles are uh, changed fully in plastics. We cannot judge the plastic is good or not because plastic, the, the bottle of plastic is not good. <coughs> Instead of mirror bottles. They are uh, not good in society. Now, nowadays, uh, the people are like uh, all uh, types of plastic things, utensils, as well as in, they handle too easy to one place to another place. Uh, mm -hmm. All the people uh, are, uh, are uh, want us to put their, uh, uh, these things in our, our homes, like flowers, just like flowers, utensils, bags, toys, uh, plastic items, all items, they have to urge to put there in our homes, yes. Okay. Thank you very much, Riaz. Thank you, Riaz. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you very welcome. much. You're welcome. Yeah. Okay, Nafia, can you hear me now? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. yes. Yeah. Okay, so you can continue what you were saying about um, reducing the use of plastic. Uh, yes, ma'am. I just said that we can 
we should stop avoiding things that are completely made of plastic and uh, the, the people who know how to sew we can like tell them to sew uh, like uh, clothes bags instead of plastics that they give in the grocery shops or in the malls and uh, when we are buying food at a restaurant or any other takeout delivery we shouldn't ask them for um, we shouldn't ask them for pack, plastic packaging we should like tell them that we should give them a box and they can give it because we are taking out that thing it's co it's completely covered in oil and the thing is going to waste so it's redu it's uh, it's increasing the plastic waste more so we should re reduce all these three points in my perspective okay very good excellent thank you very much Navya thank you ma'am Okay, next we have Sonny. Sonny, can you hear me okay? Yes, I'm here. Excellent. So, Sonny, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? Yes, ma'am. My name is Sonny Haswani. I am from Satna MP. I am 22 years old. I am postgraduated and taking tuition classes at my school. And if I talk about my today's day, so yes, it was good day because today I'm making so much printing with my students. And uh, I draw uh, like scenery and so many things we are drawing together. So it's being a fun for me and my students. Thank you. Fantastic. Okay, Sonny. So how can we reduce or stop the use of plastic? Then firstly, we have to avoid using plastic. Instead, uh, we have to use, uh, if we go for uh, uh, traveling, if we go for traveling, so normally what we see that they serve a tea in a plastic, which was, and it, this plastic is very cheap in quality. So we, we avoid this type of plastic. They are, we, if government should prefer that stop using plastic, they are using a paper, a paper or a paper a cup instead of plastic because plastic is very harmful. For us, it is very dangerous. While when we heated up the plastic, when we heated the plastic, it contained very harmful gases, which is very harmful for our health and for our uh, outside. Because uh, whenever we go outside, we just inhale it, and it comes in our side. So it contains uh, so many harmful diseases. So that's why we have to we avoid plastic, like in a restaurant. Children mostly uh, they are using plastic because uh, because they just every whatever we order they only served in a plastic box because they are very harmful they just serve in a hot a hot dishes in it and it uh, it harmful gases are whole completely absorbed in our dish and whatever we eat it come in our side so that's a very bad I mostly prefer that uh, in a hotel they are using uh, aluminium boxes because aluminium boxes are good for our health that's why it's good for everybody and even kids are also using too much use of plastic like they uh, like a, a summer vacation they just uh, want to buy a fruity they want any other things they're just using a straw to dip it so straw is also good for health so yes that's the point then. thank you excellent very good thank you very much thank very you. good very good Okay, so next we have Samikya. Samikya, hi Samikya, how are you? Hello, ma'am. Hi Samikya, so can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your day? Yes, ma'am. Good evening, everyone. My name is Samikya Samradhana. I am studying in class 7 and I will go to 8th standard after a few days only. And uh, and I'm living in India at Odisha, Varambur, and my hobbies are to join painting from time. Thank you. Today I woke up at 2.30 because I, I have my last exams today. So I have to study. Uh, today I have two exams. So the, after this exam, my exams are completed. So I'm free today. After And uh, after I came back home at uh, 10, uh, yes, at 10 o'clock, I had to had my breakfast and I have to go to school for my vaccination today. I went to school at 11.30 and I have to wait for one and a half an hour for my vaccination. After completion of my vaccination, and it's my first dose and after that, I was on 
uh, my hand was little fading so i just uh, i just uh, came home and just watched tv for some time and then i take rest uh by at a uh, after that i slept and then when i woke up i was I, i don't have anything to do because my exams are completed so i just uh, watched tv again for some time and then i uh, do a video call to my friend and we talk a little bit and after that i join your class excellent very good thank you very much thank okay you. so samika can you tell us how can we reduce or stop the use of plastic Yes, ma'am. First of all, I want to say that uh, we can reduce the use of plastic by using the jute bags while going for shopping. Um, if we will use those jute bags, so there will be no. Uh, uh, we if we will use the jute bags, so we can avoid the use of plastic bag, or also we can use our cloth bag too, and also. Mm -hmm. and the next so the second point is i want to say that we the three r's we should use that is the reduce reuse and recycle Very we can good. Uh, recycle the uh, we can recycle the plastics or uh, after like uh, if we will buy a bottle uh, for plastic of uh, for drinking water we can use it for 3 to 4 times i think so uh, i used i used for 3 to 4 times and i throw it uh, but Uh, before throwing it, if there is a like um, some uh, some came no someone came and tell the kabadi walas, so I we used to give those plastic bottles without throwing it. If we will throw it, so it can cause pollution too. So we can give them this, so you they can re recycle it, or uh, or they can. No, they I think they will not throw it, no, because they will take and recycle it. This uh, and the third point I want to say that uh, while uh, while the uh, Like uh, the if the shopkeeper is selling something like a bread, uh, it's a it's a it's not a liquid thing or it's not a oily thing. So he no uh, he should not use the plastic covering. He can use the paper covering for that. So in that in that way also we can reduce the use of uh, plastic. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, so some very good ideas. Would anyone like to add anything else before we uh, finalize uh, and finish off this class? Anyone like to add anything else? No, ma'am, no. Okay. Uh, okay. Everything is okay, okay. Ma'am. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, any questions, guys? Okay, so guys, thank you very much for joining today's class and suggesting about how we can reduce and stop the use of plastic. As you know, it's very important to do this because we are looking looking at um at future generations and sustainability. And if we keep using plastic and seeing what damage we're doing to the oceans, uh, you've mentioned straws, plastic straws, they find their, their way into, into our oceans and then we are killing off loads of, loads of organisms, loads of animals um, in, in the ocean. Why? Because they cannot distinguish plastic from food and they eat it thinking it's food, it's not food, it's detrimental towards these animals and we are ruining our environment with the use of plastic and the burning of plastic which is awful as well um, and the problem with plastic it is that it stays there in the environment, it does not degrade so easily. Uh, yes Sonny, what would you like to add please? Ma'am, in India mostly I saw that people are throwing the plastic Uh, pollutants in the road and they can't think about it that a cow or a other animal they just eat it and it is bad for their health also because it it gets stuck in their vocal cords and on the uh, after a two three days they die because of some stupidity of people exactly exactly that is precisely the case uh, and yes. navia would you like to add something else uh, yes ma'am uh, ma'am in america what they do is that in every cafe uh, or a, uh, most probably they take they take in uh, like delivery so what people over there do is that they don't give the straw whenever they order a drink they just give the whole cup and they make a they cut a whole lot of it then people drink over there and that is also and people recycle that also so they never do and they never um, they never waste any plastic because they are never giving any straw so that's why 
uh, very creative of them. That's right. Very good. Excellent. Uh, well, God, well, oh, Miss Man, you want to add something else as well? Yes. <laughs> uh, yes, ma'am. I wanted to add that. Ma'am, I wanted to add that. Uh, mm -hmm. Like, actually, what happens in India for what we are charged? Suppose recently, what happened? Like, recently, a long ago, uh, when people were not wearing, um, uh, like, we're not uh, wearing belts when they are in the car. Seat belt and they, um, when they are uh, riding a bike, they are not wearing the helmet. They have been charged for that. And they are, unless a person is charged, they don't stop doing that. So I feel like once a, peep, a person starts getting charged for the falls, the person will stop doing that. Until, unless the person gets the um, uh, like get the disease of like uh, disease that uh, that is like um, get that that's because of plastic. The person would ever understand the, that plastic is really bad. We should stop it. So it's like if if every one of us is charged because of a bad behavior, we try to improve it. Like that only. If we are charged for uh, you uh, like for throwing plastic on the road, we will be not doing it ever because money is very precious for everyone. That's what like life is like. Money is more precious than anyone else's life. That's why everyone ruins a uh, animal's life and they throw the plastic on the ground. Thank you. That is all true. Thank you very much, guys. This has sparked some great conversation in this class and I've really enjoyed it. Um, thank you for all the research that you've done and uh, I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. Hope you have a good evening. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.